Bundy's Garage, John Bundy here. Hey, today I'm out in the field and just wanted to show you a review of a differential cover for a uh, Ford Mustang. The one on the left is a high performance Ford Racing differential cover, and the one on the right is a stock one. So let me show you what happens. As you can see, this one, um, this was on a Mustang, a Mustang Cobra, and this is a stock. This is stock differential. I just wanted to show you guys this um, in my buddy's shop, and he's um, actually fixing this, repairing the gears as well. Uh, this customer was racing the uh, was racing the Mustang. He went around the turn, actually did a U-turn, and uh, all of a sudden he heard just a loud popping explosion sound. Gets out of the car and takes a look underneath, and all the differential fluid is on the is on the concrete, and his differential cover get his differential cover is destroyed, basically grenaded. So, as you can see, I tried to assemble it back together as well as possible, but uh, it is pretty messed up. You can't, you can't salvage this thing. And uh, here's the inside of it. Take a look at the the um, the thickness of the of the cover. It's not very thick at all. Like I said, this is a stock one. I'll be showing you uh, the uh, the Ford Racing one here in a second. But uh, yeah, this thing's pretty much toast. Cannot fix this, cannot weld this. You're gonna get another stock cover or you're gonna upgrade to to this bad boy. This is a Ford Racing differential cover. This thing is solid. I mean, you can see how thick this thing is compared to the stock one. I mean, this is not, you're not messing around with this thing. This thing retails for about $280 from a local Ford dealership. And as you can see, Right here and here are two magnets to uh, collect the uh, the metal shavings that might get, you know, might might be tossed around inside the uh, cover from the uh, the gears. These two are actually fill points. These ones down here are drain plugs, and the reason they did that is because you can put accessories. I, I want to say accessories, but you can actually um, attach a bracket that goes from these two points onto the back back of the Mustang to the subframe. To make the uh, rear axle a little bit more rigid, so that's why they did that. They give you multiple options for filling and draining. So, like I said, this is draining, draining, a fill plug, a fill plug. So this thing is pretty sweet, you know, a lot better than the uh, stock OEM one. But I just want to show you guys this, show you what's out there for Ford racing parts. And what else is in the box? You get new bolts. And it looks like uh, they're, they're hard plastic washers as well in there. These aren't soft. And, I mean, I'm squeezing them here in the bag, and they, they are hard, hard washers. And uh, the bolts are Allen. I don't want to open up this bag because it's not mine to open. But if you guys can see that right there. Allen, Allen bolts. So top quality stuff, you know, they're not messing around. And uh, if I can show, I'll show you here the directions that came with it. Put that down on the box. I don't want it to sit on the ground, damage the uh, the surface of the uh, cover on these rocks here. But so here you go. Ford Racing M-4033-G3. -dash -dash Axle girdle installation instructions. Um, one axle girdle assembly, ten washers and ten bolts. Uh, let's see, I'm looking for a uh, looking for a model number, serial number, but I don't see any. So yeah, showing you what's out there for Ford Racing. It says it fits. Uh, this kit is for use on 8.8 .8 inch independent axle housings on 1999 to 2004 Cobra Mustangs. So I'll show you the uh, part number on the side of the box. All right. So there you guys go. They're about to work on it. So I got to go. Like always, if you like my videos, please subscribe. And I'll keep them rolling for you guys so you guys can keep, uh, 
seeing what's out there in the world of automotive.